the last thing before we go tonight. Remembering a broadcast legend, Vin Scully, the voice of the Los Angeles Dodgers, passed away yesterday at the extraordinary age of 94. The L.A. Times writes, the way Vin Scully called a baseball game, it felt like bumping into an old friend. There were stories to tell and memories to share. His soothing banter, as familiar as green grass and warm breezes on a sunny afternoon. NBC's Miguel Almaguer takes a look back on his life and legacy. It's time for Dodger Baseball. With those easy words and his unmistakable voice, Vin Scully cemented a legacy as legendary as those of the players he called. Slow curveball. See you later. Armed with a mastery of the game and the grace of a folksy friend, Scully brought the field to life during his 67-year career. There's uh, 29,000 people in the ballpark and a million butterflies. As the Dodgers play-by-play man, he marked American history when Hank Aaron smashed Babe Ruth's home run record. A black man is getting a standing ovation in the deep south. More than a decade later. Look who's coming up. When an injured Kirk Gibson gave the underdog Dodgers a walk-off World Series game win, Scully perfectly captured what only he could coin. In a year that has been so improbable, the impossible has happened. Born in the Bronx in 1927, the slender redhead first began calling games for the Brooklyn Dodgers at 22. When he retired in 2016, he was awarded the Medal of Freedom. I've needed you far more than you needed me. Though Vin Scully never played for the Dodgers, he was the face of a franchise who left the field with the grace of a legend. Miguel Almaguer, NBC News, Los Angeles. An impressive life and career that will not be forgotten.